Hi everybody, good afternoon. This is Marisha's mom. Today we're going to make some nice apple cobbler for you with the apples that Marisha and I picked from the off the tree ourselves at the uh, farm. I took these apples and I put them in some nice sudsy water and I scrubbed them all really well. So they're ready to be baked. Here's what you'll need. We're going to start off by cutting the apples into one inch cubes and we're going to transfer them into an oven safe baking dish. So now we're adding 3 quarters cup of sugar, we're going to add our cinnamon, we're going to add our maybe a little allspice, and then we're going to mix it all up together. We're going to add some lemon juice, some lemon zest would also be a good idea and then we're going to toss it. Okay, we have our big bowl. We have our two cups of flour in here. We're adding two cups of sugar. We're adding our baking powder and salt. Our two eggs. Some vanilla. And cinnamon. Just going to sprinkle generously. Now we're just going to stir it. Or you can use the mixer but we want to make a crumbly topping. Okay, your mixture is going to be kind of crumbly. This is what you're looking for. A lot of texture. Then we're just going to pour it over top of our apples. Now we're just going to pour our melted butter over top of the crumbly mixture and the apples. So we're going to put this in the oven at a temperature of 350 degrees for 50 minutes. This smells amazing. Yay. It looks amazing, doesn't it? Marissa? It looks great. I can't wait to cut I into know. this. This would be great with some ice cream or some whipped cream. I served with um ice cream or whipped cream. I was going to say that. <laughs> All right, we're going to dig into this. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks if you want to follow and see more pictures, you can go to facebook.com slash Marisha's Couture Cakes. You can go to the blog at Marisha's Couture Cakes .com for the full recipe. And visit us on Instagram. Couture in Mommy's Delicious Apple Cobbler. Bye, guys. Yeah, bye. This was literally one of the best apple desserts that I've ever had in my entire life. It was absolutely amazing. So don't forget to check the blog for the full recipe to make it in time for Thanksgiving and for Christmas. Don't forget to check the orchard video and my delicious raspberry custard tart. Bye guys.